Okay, Scott, what we're going to go through is the next three big changes we're looking for on your serve. On the right side over here, we have your full video. We're going to play it through just so you can have a look at what it looks like from the outside. Then over here on the left, we're going to have three of the points that we want to have uh, as the next big changes. So over here on the right again, we're going to play through your three serves. So that's the action we're working with at the moment. Now we're going to go back over to the left side. So over here, our first one that we talked about was during your setup, you have uh, your left arm away from the body. So what we're going to try and do is you see here the stick figures, left the right leg is straight, left leg should be straight, and then you're going to have a posture that will be a little bit more upright to start with. The main point is we want to have that left arm touching your left leg. So from that position, instead of having the down action, so from here, you can see yourself, it rises, rises, and then you start to do a few complicated things because of where that arm and where that racket has to travel. So what we're going to look to do is when you start off, left arm touches your left leg and then plays through. So you look back over on the right. I'm trying to start with that left arm touching. Now, second point, once that left arm rises up and you've started your swing, we're going to end up in this position. So at the moment, we've got our shoulders, or your shoulders are a little bit too straight. So what we're looking for is that left arm to be a little bit higher, the right arm to be somewhere back here near your hip. So again, your legs are going to be straight. You're going to have a pretty straight posture, and then the angle of your shoulders are going to be on that kind of 45 degree angle. Okay? So to get to that point, the ball toss is going to go first and then as you come up we're going to get to this point here so you still all tra rackets traveling backwards legs and bodies probably in a neutral position and our third one that we're looking for the most important one at the moment when we get to this position your left hip all the weights heading forwards now but that kicks out through your hip so your hips are going to be an angle up this way and then your shoulders are going to be an angle up this way. So the two points we're looking for here is left arm is going to be along this 45 degrees still. As you load up, this elbow is going to be kicking back here somewhere behind you. So then that position, everything you got as you launch up to hit, you're going to launch into the court and you're going to head towards where you want to go. That's going to help you straighten up a little bit. So when you fall, you're going to follow those two lines a little bit straighter. So recap again. First one, left arm is going to start touching your left leg. Second one, you're going to keep your left arm up and elbow back. And then third one, you're going to hold that position until you fall and launch your body into the court in the direction that you're hitting. So they're the three things we're working on. So we're going to have a look at those, practice them along the way and uh, we'll get you served to the next level. All right, thanks, Scott.